What's up guys, my name is Dominic and for you guys today I'm bringing you episode number 3 of my base visit series and if you want to be featured in future episodes then all the details are in the description but enough for the chit chat, this video is going to be long enough as it is. So first off here we're going to have from Zombieland, Zeus the Moose. No, what am I on about? That's an expert thief. Alright, so level 54 and we have a Town Hall 7 here and first looks of it he looks like a brand new Town Hall 7 from the level 1 air defense and yep so yep it definitely looks like he just hit Town Hall 7 I think he did max out everything for a Town Hall 8 I mean there 6 because okay, again it's long ago since I was Town Hall 6 so I can't even remember the max boundaries but anyway so looking at your base, it, nice base design air sweeper I turn it the other direction just to protect the two air, air defences uh, it's not much use in that position clan castle you've maxed it out already for your town hall level so that's great um, what else is there walls yep get all those level 5 walls to level 6 and then all those level 6 to level 7 again this air defence just get it to that level 5 or yeah max is level 5 so get both those air defences level 5 and of course army camps another main priority I think you have one more to do no. oh you have one level 4 one okay oh yeah you do get a new army camp at town hall at town hall 7 I think that is so again yep you're upgrading that so just get that maxed out as well so you can get a full 200 troops and you're not gonna have to worry about it for another ta town hall because town hall 8 you don't need to do nothing to it so again what else is there to do Spell Factory, I think, yep, get a Spell Factory upgraded because I know you can get Rage Spell at Town Hall 8. So definitely get the Spell Factory upgraded. Well, well, if you spent a lot of gold, I think that is on flags. So well done there. It looks really nice, makes your base look nice. And yeah, so just keep upgrading the walls, upgrade the defenses, especially air defenses and the walls. And just turn the air sweeper to the other direction, in my opinion, so that you can make full use of it. But other than that, good job and keep going on the Town Hall 7 stuff so now yep you're Town Hall 7 so you're gonna have a Barbarian King soon that is definitely for me when I got my King I gemmed it so what you wanna do you do but get, definitely save up Dark Elixir to get a Barbarian King I don't know if you've built the storage yet yes you have and you are halfway there halfway there so that's good and again so just I know you just turned Town Hall 7 from the looks of it, so just keep upgrading your stuff. There's not much I can critique on it at the moment, just give you advice on because you just turned a new Town Hall and I'm assuming you maxed out the Town Hall 6. Again, so just keep farming well. I know you're in a you're in quite a good war clan. Get those war stars up, get the 150 achievement, get that handful of gems, and just keep doing what you're doing at the moment. So well done, expert thief, and thanks for the uh Entry. Okay, so second here we have the ginger kid from Four Play. So where is he? That ginger kid. That ginger kid. The ginger kid. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay, level eighty-five here, and looks of his base. It is a town hall 8 yes it's a town hall 8 and this base design looks really scary in my opinion it looks solid actually those level 7 walls look amazing and yep got my full collectors I can tell from the I mean full storages and I can tell from the collectors as well you can't really collect that much loot so again so with this base design I'll just give you some tips on I'd say put the king back into the center maybe I think you just upgraded the king and I f that's what I'm assuming you upgraded the king and put him on the outside but don't keep him on the outside there all the time because trying to save up dark clicks so the king is vital to, to defend as well as the normal defenses itself again looking at your air defenses that's amazing you're maxing those air defenses out thing I would do as well the walls your walls are looking awesome you've got quite a good few of level 8 ones there again just get all the level 8 ones done um, air sweeper level 1 yep you're upgrading it as well to level 2 so that's good and just I'd say just turn it towards the uh, opposite side so that you can make full use of full use of it as well protecting that one air defense in particular again nice farming base you've maxed out your 
army camp, so that's great. And yo, what much to say about this base? It's, you're doing awesome at the moment. Um, you look like a solid town or eight. So let's just take a look at your troops now. And again, Barbarian King level 8, Hog Riders only level 2, I'd say get them to level 4. You're in a level 4 clan, I'm assuming you do do wars. You've got 161 war stars, so I'd say get those Hog Riders to level 4. And that's your main strategy in wars, to so start practicing it and you'll be awesome. Looking at your spells, so heal spells and rage spells look amazing. Lightning spell, not so much at the moment, but it's not that expensive early on. And it just makes your profile look alright, so that you're not neglecting too many stuff. Again, so what else is there? Um, dragons you maxed out for Town Hall 8. I think that's the main war troops I think you'd use for a beginner Town Hall 8. But once you're getting more advanced, looking at your base, it is looking good. So start getting those Hog Riders done. And also just upgrade those Dark spells, especially the Poison spell, as that's really the spell you're going to need when you're trying to eliminate the troops. And looking at your Gold Grab, it's great, and Elixir Grab. You've passed the achievement, you've maxed the achievement for that, past 100 million, so that's awesome. Again, Heroic Heist for Dark Elixir. Keep farming that Dark Elixir, get onto that second achievement there. And your War Hero as well, you've got the second star for the War Hero. And yeah, you're doing alright at the moment. Donations looking well, 25,000. So yeah, just keep upgrading those stuff, keep upgrading those walls and Barbarian Kim getting maxed out and put him into the middle of a base just to help protect your base a lot better. But anyways, thanks for submitting to my ep my series. Okay, and third here we're gonna have Joshua from the Prestors. Um, where is he? Prestors. And Joshua, nice and easy. He's right at the top there. His channel is cl cl Clash with Ducks. I think that is. If you want to check him out as well, he's a YouTuber. And looking at the base, Town Hall Nine, and it is looking very nice at the moment very nice indeed so again look at the bit look at the air sweepers first thing very nicely placed it's not touching the air defense but as you can see it goes outwards it is protecting that air defense quite well again with a second s the air sweeper thing i was talking about yeah great level level four each and it's looking good your walls are looking amazing you've got no level seven walls i don't think that is yeah, you've got no level 7, you've got a nice chunk of level 9 in the centre there. I think you're going to keep upgrading those walls. And honestly, you're looking, your base is looking at solid at the moment. Air defences, I say just get them to level 7. They're very good when you have them higher to protect yourself in wars against Gola Luna attack strategies. Because you are in level 4 clan, but I still assume you do, you do do wars as well. Heroes wise, level 11 queen and king going to level... 12 so that's solid level heroes as well i can see you are in new town hall 9 and your walls are amazing expos going level 2 i say don't put them to level 3 because that will keep you quite high in the war maps just keep them in level 2 like i have at the moment and yeah so what else is there to say keep those air archer towers at level 10 for now along with the cannons maybe get a cannons level 11 i've got mine level 11 but again dark elixir drills i'd say upgrade the dark elixir drill max that one out and your other one is opposite of the side of the map again get that level six as well but other than that it's a brilliant looking base and yeah let's just take a look at your troops so troops wise level three golems i'm assuming you're trying to max those out as soon as you can um heroes again level 12 king level 11 queen your dark elixir spells are just standing out because they're all level one i'd say just upgrade those dark elixir spells especially the poison spell and that would be awesome and just check in dragon level four that's that's quite that's really good dragon level four that's i haven't even got that yet so that's awesome i'm getting that pekka's already level three that's good minions level five that's max for town hall nine what else is that balloons level six so yeah, your profile is looking really good. Just upgrade those Dark Elixir troops towards the end. Those are the big heavy troops there. So just get the Witch Max, the Golems Max, and the Lava Hound to level 2 as well. And looking at your achievements, Gold Grab, 240 million and 240 million as well. Elixir Grab, so that's really good as well. You're a great farmer by the looks of it. War Stars, 548. That's amazing. But your Spoils of War isn't as much as what your war stars would like link up together so i'm assuming you clan or yeah i'm assuming you don't win too many wars but still awesome clan i think you have there 
And yeah, what else to say there is good dark elixir highs, just get that last achievement and yeah, just keep up the good work, keep maxing those walls out and getting your heroes upgraded. So then next one here, fourth one here, um, we have um, Colin from Zeus the Moose 4. Zeus the Moose 4, we have Colin, again, nice and easy, right at the top. He's a pusher as well, and, oh, it's a Town Hall 10 here, but it's quite a rush Town Hall 10, if you don't mind me saying that. Um, all right, so wait, this might be a long, it's going to be quite a lot of critique, so I hope you don't mind that, but you are quite a rush Town Hall 10, so... I just want to be honest with you there. So what should I say? Okay, so start off here. Um, I'd say Mac, get those walls all like level seven. Just stop upgrading the defenses for now, because you are in a level five clan, and I'm assuming you do do walls there, level five clan. I say don't upgrade any more defenses, because you're going to attract harder opponents. And with your army camps, you've only got 205 space out of 240 which is the max for Town Hall 10, so I'd say don't upgrade any more defenses, keep it the way it is at the moment, just upgrade the walls, definitely upgrade your heroes because they're level 7 and level 6, that is uh, start of a Town Hall 9 level, so other than that, um, again, a Air Sweep is in a very nice position, that one there, I'm looking for the other one, um, can't f oh there it is, out of a base, um, yeah just that, yeah, just put that one in the base as well if this is your if you're trying to push because that will help you a lot as well from air attacks. But yeah, just you have rushed to town all ten a bit, but it's all right. You can still recover from that. Just keep upgrading your walls and your heroes, and leave your other defenses untouched for now until you get your walls to at least level eight or level eight and. Yeah, because as you upgrade your defenses, you're going to get harder opponents in war when you search for wars. So let's just take a look at your troops now, and dragons level 4, I saw that in your camps. That's a really good pushing troop, I think. Other than that, you've got, a, wow, you have amazing war stars. Jesus, I've never seen something that high, but your spoils of war is quite low as well. But I'm assuming you do attack quite low, but gosh, that war hero, that... That's something to be proud of, honestly, that's amazing. 948 stars, I haven't seen anything that high before, so congrats on that. And again, so just, yeah, so just keep upgrading your troops, upgrade your spells. You have a rush Town Hall 10, so just just make your profile look a lot better. Stop upgrading the defenses, and you can get yourself, you can recover yourself to be a much better Town Hall 10. So what else is there? Um, last one here we have... Mr. IDGT from Unseen Glory, there a level one clan, and there you go, level fifty-eight here, and it's a town or seven, and that is a solid town or seven by the looks of it from those purple walls. So, again, this doesn't look like too much critique going on, but just advice on what I think you will do anyway. So. One critique here, air sweeper first off, just twist that air sweeper in the opposite direction just to protect your air defences more. Um, what else is there? Just the walls, keep maxing those walls out. Once they're level 7 for a Town Hall 7, it is solid. Again, your Barbarian King, get him to level 5 once you farm all that Dark Elixir there you have. Um, what else is there? Dark Elixir Drill, I think you can get to level 2, so I just say get that to level 2 and then you can easily get dark elixir as well camps all maxed out that's great and what can i have too much to say i think you've maxed out all your defenses except the wizard tower and yeah what much can i say you've maxed out your barracks so yeah brilliant town or seven and your troops wise dragons level two minions level two just get your hogs level two because i know you can get them level two for town or seven i think your spells you can upgrade your heal and rage one more time and yeah so gold grab is looking okay i think for that town or seven i can't remember what mine was at town or seven but yeah just keep upgrading that um what else is there wall stars they're looking all right you've you've broke through a hundred spoils of war achievement just get that second one just keep boring more i don't think you're in a war clan if i just check your clan oh you do do wars but i don't think you do too many as you're level one and you say always so or you're just a new clan but anyway other than that looking at your base it is solid so keep up the good work fully max out tunnel 7 and then go tunnel 8 and do the same for that but anyway yep that is it thank you for submitting your base and yes guys that's it for the video thanks for watching and just if you want to be reviewed just put it in the description
I mean in the comment section. That's it from me guys and bye bye.